And here we go, our first crew of the day is in on approach, and he's actually already missed once. And this is his second attempt to come back in on the trailer. A little strange though, he was on the dock that you see right here that's open with the trailer in, and then he backed all the way out and then missed on the first approach. I'm not sure why they didn't just walk it up from right there, but here we go, attempt number two on the way. So, has a little funky angle, has to brake check it out, has to be careful that he doesn't hit the boat over there, and he reverses out pretty heavy to try and make sure he stays away from them. But welcome back, crew, to the greatest show on Earth, and that is the Miami Boat Ramps channel. I'm your host, Broncos Guru, and today we are down here visiting Boynton Beach. So, little throttle happy there, kind of tries to swing it back around, but he's definitely a little bit out of whack right now, probably going to have a tough time coming in from this angle. And again, decides to back out. He doesn't even want to mess with it. And now he gets a little close to us over here in the trees. Gotta be careful. It's a little shallow over here. So now he's gonna back way out, it looks like, and try and completely reset up. I don't disagree with that approach. And gonna have to throttle it back up and try and line this one up again. So here we go, coming back on approach. I believe this is attempt number four now. giving himself plenty of room this time. So he lines it up. And he's kind of coming in a little hot. We look pretty committed on this one. And he's able to slow it down just before he gets to the trailer. And we're drifting a little bit to the starboard side though. He's gonna have to bring it back around. And no, he's just going to let it drift. And he winds up taking out the guide pole. I don't know if it snapped or if he knocked it off or what. But he took it completely out on the starboard side. So he's leaving the helm, walking up. So it looks like he's going to try and pull this one off by himself, basically, as he's put it onto the trailer. And now he left the helm, went over the bow, and he's going to be the one winching the boat up. I don't even know if anybody noticed the guy pull because nobody's gone after it. <laughs> They're just going to sit there and try and get it leveled up from here. Now, I'm not 100% sure what's going on, but it took them quite a while, actually, to get this thing winched up and on the trailer. But it looks like we're finally done. As I can see, the guy's getting in the truck now. Let's see how the pullout goes. Oh! I don't know what happened there, but something went wrong. So it, it's... I wonder if he didn't lock the winch and it maybe slid back? Whatever it was, it didn't sound good because it sounded like something broke, but I'm just not 100% sure. So he's back out of the truck up there looking at it. And it looks like the boat's coming back up, so he's winching it back up again. So I don't think the winch broke because I can see the boat lifting. One of his buddies is now running back down the dock, though. So he's back in the truck. One of his friends is in the boat now for some reason. And here we go again. Oh! Oh! <laughs> And they did it a second time. What in the world is going on there? And now he's backing the truck even deeper than it was before. The whole boat's floating now. I, I'm just wondering if it's just not locked. Uh, let me know in the comments what you guys think that, that is. I, once again, it's tough from this angle for us to be able to tell. Obviously, something's going on. 
So they took their sweet time on this one. And here we go. We're about to try it again. Let's see if she holds this time. It slid back down again. He's going to keep going this time. And they're going to pull it out. So they grab the boat hook. This one's pretty easy now. You just pull the boat over, right? So she's looking back like she's ready to hop, but she's waiting for him to pull it over. What? He... I'm confused. You had the boat hook on the dock. All you had to do was pull the boat over. He left and looks like he almost put it in gear. So now the stern kicks in. He steps off the dock with no lines. It looks like she's got the boat hook now. What in the world are they doing? I mean, this should have been the easiest setup ever. Boat hook, grab a cleat, pull her over. I mean, they get it done, but I felt like there were some extra steps there for some reason that didn't need to be done. I mean, that's one of my favorite tools on the boat. If you guys boat and you don't have a boat hook, that's how easy it is with a boat hook. They were six foot off the dock, and it doesn't matter. You grab the hook, grab the cleat, pull yourself over. There's none of this messing with the throttle, trying to get a little closer so somebody can jump off. Basically, you just grab it and pull, pull yourself in. So our crew is trying to get the skis launched. And the guy on the right-hand ski, for some reason, he tried bouncing it off a few seconds ago, and it just didn't work. So, you can see him rocking it back and forth. And doing the old baby jet ski maker, but it's not coming off. So, he's getting a couple inches here and there as he tries to get it done. But it definitely seems like a more difficult path. And somebody came from the truck, and it looks like they're going to try and push the other ski off from the trailer. <laughs> and my man is getting it. He's like, I'm getting off this thing no matter what. So they push the other ski off. I guess he can give his boy a hand now, but he's just kind of staring at him. And there we go. He's going to go up front and try and kick it off with his foot. And it looks like he's floating now. He should be good to go. And speaking of good to go, we're going to go ahead and get out of here as well. Thanks for watching, crew. I hope you enjoyed this episode of Miami Boat Ramps. If you did, please check out our other content. We have Wavy Boats, who does a bunch of great things down at the inlet. My channel, Broncos Guru, do some great comedy boating videos there as well. And of course, we've got Boats vs. Haulover, where man and machine take on Mother Nature down at Haulover Inlet. And if you guys haven't already, go ahead and drop an anchor on the subscribe button here.